Alrighty guys, what up? Welcome back to my channel. They were doing it again. As you can read from the title, I'm reviewing or re-reviewing this ColourPop liquid lipstick, the new formula. Now I have not tried ColourPop in a really, really, really long, long time. It's been about close to two years since I haven't tried. I have tried the old formula and I decided to redo these liquid lipstick reviews, see how I rank them, see what has changed, see, you know, if I like it or not, you know, see if it's good or not, see if it's good, see if these six dollars are worth done or not. So, let's give it a go and I will see you guys in a little bit. Alrighty. I have nothing on my lips. So, we are going to start off by prepping our lips or I'll show you how I prep my lips because any sign of dryness or cracking, I recommend a, especially for liquid lipsticks, they attach you to your lips like, like a lab and they stick. Yeah, just saying. Is any random, this is a $3 one, a lip scrub. It could be three dollars, twenty dollars, fifteen, or whatever price. Or you can obviously DIY it from some kitchen item at your home. So recommend you to prep the lips. This is three dollars and it's brown sugar. And it's well loved by me. Well loved. It smells good too. You to prep your lips. Also any random the meal chapstick or lip balm whatever you choose to call these this is from the brand soft lips and these are kind of pricey i believe but i got this like at a box charm or like influencer box a while back and it does the job right just make sure you prep your lips now the color obviously if you can read from the title it is sunday that i got and this is this came out a couple months ago this color came out a couple of months ago, and all of them have been reformulated, and I have not tested these out since, like, oof, wow, since I started my channel. So, this is a new formula. We'll see if I can remember or how the old formula and the new formula do compare. So, let's see. Same applicator, obviously. Does smell a little bit chemically. Let's see what it looks like on. Just swatch. Pinky. Hmm. Let's see what it looks like on the lips. One swipe. One swipe. Hmm. One swipe and we are done. Now, from what I remember from the old formula, hmm, dries fast, which obviously, and it's only $6. I do feel it from right here, and the old formula was a lot more drying than this one it's not like sandpaper on the lips but like right here in the corners of the lips i do feel it it is drying but not that drying this is what it came up to with the swatch which does look a lot darker on my hand than on my lips See, no transfer. So I am going to wear this for a couple of hours. I will not touch it. I will eat with it, drink with it, 
see how it goes. I will come back in a couple of hours and tell you how I like it. If it's good, if it's bad, do I recommend it? It is currently kind of late in the day, but still, it's early afternoon. Well, technically. So I will come back and we will see, and then I'll do another swatch and see how it layers. But I will not touch the stick with lipstick. But it's pinky. Every day, pinky color. Yeah. We'll see how it wears. Clearly, it has rubbed off. It is currently 6.39 right now. Corn on a cob. Two hot dogs and greasy noodles. Yeah. Obviously, with greasy food, you have to reapply. Or depending on what type of food or the grease level of the food. So, really, really impressed with these. Finally, they have changed the formula because the old formula was very, very dry. <sighs> Suck your lips. This, not so much. I do enjoy the new formula. Obviously, there's various, various colors. Colourpop is known, and it's inexpensive. Also, if you want the higher-end version, which is technically the Kylie Jenner ones, but these are a lot cheaper. These are really, really comfortable. They're comfortable. The only con I do have with these are right here. Like, the sides of my lips, I feel, like, super, super dry, like the corners of my lips. And that's where it faded the first time I ate. It faded right here. Like right here. Not so much, not so noticeable, but it does fade on the corner lips. It does not give you that oh that um ring around your lips. It does fade gradually, but it doesn't give you that. You know that lip the lip. The butt lip. <laughs> <laughs> it does not do that. It does fade gradually. Obviously, with food, with water, with drink, with talking, with you know, with fluid in the mouth, you know, spit and all that, does rub off, you know. With wiping your lips like this, it does wipe off. Hey, it happens. But it does fade gradually, which I like. Would I recommend it? Yeah. Now. Let's see how it does when I reapply it. And yeah. Obviously, it's really good reapplied. There was nothing on my lips to begin with <laughs> because the food and the grease did, you know, swiped it away. But still, it's really good way of applying for several hours of no putting, this is without putting any lipstick on or uh, lip balm beforehand. Dries really quickly, which I like. Let's see how it does on the kissing. Hmm, there is some transfer. Obviously, I barely put it on right now, so. Give it another minute. Let's see another kiss test. It is a little bit of transfer. You gotta wait for a minute to fully, fully dry. Does it give it a minute? But overall. Still, the corners of my lips. That's the only con I have with this, the corners of my lips, and it does fade right here, even with just regular, you know, saliva, it does fade here, but I'm very impressed, would I rank these as a recommendation, I would say for the price, it's $6, it's Colourpop, I don't hate them, I don't love them, I would say, I would probably rank them one to five is highly recommended, yes. Six through six through ten is maybe recommendation. Yes I would, but 
I like him, but I don't love him. You know what I mean? And then 11 to 15, stay away from them. Not worth the money. But, I would say, comfortability wise, very comfortable. Even though right here is something that I could just go at that and it'll be fine. Just go with like that. It'll be fine. Color selection. A whole lot from really, really light, obviously. I have theme because I like pink. <laughs> and I like neutral. Neutral color. Like lipsticks. Obviously. They all look the same. <laughs> obviously, I like pinky. Beauty pinks. Everyday colors. Color-wise, really, really good. Um, wearability. Definitely, obviously you have to reapply, depends on. Uh, but, durability and wearability, I would say I'll give it to, I would say, five to eight hours. You know, it depends on what you do during the day, but, yeah, just keep it in your bag. You know, wear it throughout the day. And, packaging, regular packaging, obviously. <laughs> but still, the traditional ColourPop packaging. I haven't really changed that much since the last time I ordered these over like two years ago. And let's do another kiss test. Now, absolutely. Give it a minute to dry. Definitely would I rank these at, I would say, hmm, I don't love them, but I don't hate them. I would definitely repurchase these again because they're very inexpensive. And also, I got these on sale for like four, four like with seven uh with fifty cents so for four fifty. Technically, they were on sale like two dollars off, and I got them for Christmas, so it was like a Christmas present to me. But definitely, yeah, I would recommend them. I would say. This will be my number five. So, yeah. This will be ranked at number five. If it does change, I can always bump it down. But this is number five. I was originally going to give it number six, but number five. Because these are definitely recommended by me. Alrighty. Did you enjoy this video? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will talk to you guys later. May the Lord bless you today, tomorrow, always. And I will leave you.